Here I'm going to show you guys how to install the Radar Bro mod for Minecraft. So there's going to be two files you'll need. You'll need Mod Loader and the Radar Bro mods. You can find both of those on their forum page. Link will be in the description for you. Take you to the Radar Bro uh, forum page. You can go ahead and scroll down past the videos, and here you'll find the download link. So you will need Mod Loader. So go ahead and click the blue Mod Loader link. This will take you on over to Risugami's mods. I'll also have a link to Risugami's mods in the description for you so anyways you can go ahead and scroll on down to the mod section go to mod loader and go ahead and click download adfly or download direct if you click download adfly it'll take you on over to adfly and this is kind of glitchy if you get like a cookies is enabled or you know something like that you can go ahead and refresh or re-click the link and if you're getting a loop on the skip ad countdown button thing that's because you have ad block enabled so disable ad block when going through ad fly so there you go it'll go ahead and download mod loader for you all right after you have mod loader installed go ahead and then download the radar bro mod which is this download and on dropbox button right there so go ahead and click that button there so again we'll take you on over to adfly and you'll have to wait five seconds if you're getting a loop on the five second countdown there that's because you have ad block enabled so make sure you disable ad block when going through adfly all right so this will then download radar bro all right so then after you have these two files downloaded you can go ahead and you know drag them to a folder or onto your desktop i just think dragging it onto your desktop makes everything a, lot, a little bit simpler all right but after you have this done Go ahead to your search bar, type in percent app data percent and hit enter. All right, so this will take us on over to our roaming folder. Inside our roaming folder is our dot Minecraft folder. So go ahead and enter our dot Minecraft folder. Then go into our versions folder right here. So go ahead and double click our versions folder. All right, so now we're gonna to wanna to create a new folder in here. All right, so you can either click this new folder tab up here or you can right click, go to new and go to folder. And we're going to want to name this radar all right so just name the folder radar all right then you're going to want to go into the folder for your minecraft version as of, of uh, as of right now minecraft is 1.6.2 this tutorial will probably work you know on to updated versions of minecraft but as of right now it's 1.6.2 so enter that folder of your minecraft version you're currently in and then highlight the two file folders that are in here files or folders that are in here and then copy them all right then go back one to your versions folder and enter the radar folder that we just created and then paste those two fo the, our files in here all right so after we have these two pasted in just go ahead and highlight both of them right click go to rename and we're going to rename both of them radar all right and go ahead click off it'll rename both of them if if your json file says radar.json that is fine all right so now we're going to enter the JSON file so you can right click it, go to open with and choose notepad or something that's able to read words and then save it. So anyways, just make sure it's something like that. All right, so we're going to go ahead and open it up with notepad and we're going to go next to the ID and change our Minecraft version numbers to radar, just like we named the other things. All right, make sure you file and save if you're, um, you know, it's not right next to the ID. It's probably somewhere around here near the bottom, judging by YouTube comments. All right. So after you have that and make sure you save it, you've changed the your Minecraft version to the radar. Make sure you exit out of that now. Now enter the executable jar file, which is the other radar file that we renamed. Go to open with and choose WinRAR Archiver or 7-Zip or something like that. If you don't have WinRAR, I'll have a link to it in the description. So go ahead and click it. All right, so now that we're in now radar.jar, go ahead to find this meta-inf folder, which is normally located right at the top here with all the other folders. Right click, go to delete files and hit yes. Make sure you delete this meta-inf folder. All right, so after we have deleted meta-inf, open up mod loader now. Click on one of the files in here, just pick a file, hit control and A on your keyboard to highlight them all. So again, click on one of the file, hit control and A which highlights them all and then just drag them into your radar.jar folder and then go ahead and click OK. All right, so now that we have mod loader downloaded, we need to install Radar Bro. So go ahead and um, double click Radar Bro. Again, just click on one of the files in here, hit Control and A to highlight them all and then just drag them all over to radar.jar. Go ahead and hit OK. And there you go. That is how you install the radar.jar or the the radar bro mod so anyways let's go ahead and um open up minecraft we need to set up a profile and um uh use version thing so anyways go to new profile just name this radar 
all right and then go to use version and make sure you do release radar all right so make sure you click on release radar if it doesn't have a release radar here it's because you maybe didn't name something correctly so make sure you renamed everything to radar that you were supposed to and then go to save profile all right so make sure the profile is set to radar and then we can go ahead and click play and i'll go ahead and show you guys that you know this does work for you Anyways, again, if it does work, just go ahead and, you know, leave a link on the video to kind of help it get noticed. If you want to subscribe, but don't necessarily send these videos to sub boxes. How about, uh, however, what you can do is be able to find my channel a little bit easier. Let me turn down the sound. I don't know if this picks up in-game sound with the screen recorder. But anyways, so yeah, there you go. There's your radar bro thing. If you hit R on your keyboard, you're able to have all the things right here. So make sure radar is obviously enabled and not set to disabled. But anyway, so yeah, that's just showing you guys that, you know, this does work. So anyways, again, if it, this has helped you, just leave a link right on the video. If you want to subscribe, go ahead. If you want to check out my main channel, I have a link to my main channel in the description there. I do kind of the same thing here. However, I take a lot more time into those videos and I make a review for them. But I get to, you know, a lot fewer videos than on this channel because this channel, you know, I just quickly do a, re a tutorial for the mod and, you know, that's about it. So anyways, guys, hope this has helped and thanks for watching.